Hello. Today I want to talk about Hem of Garment and what this reminds me of is the chapter in Luke, chapter 8, where God has woven together two individuals. One, uh, Jairus, I think that's how you say his name, um, whose daughter, whose 12-year-old daughter, was dying. Um, he was feeling pretty desperate. And two, the unnamed woman who um, had been suffering from a bleeding disorder um, for 12 years. I find it uncanny that 12 is related in both of those stories. Um, but anyway, they were both very desperate. Um, and they needed to seek Jesus for healing. Um, and so they did that, and they were there at the same time. I suppose Jesus was in the crowd making his way to the man, and um, the woman noticed him, found him, and touched his garment. She was so desperate for healing. And of course, we know the story. Um, she was healed. Um, but it makes me think, have we ever felt so desperate that um, we needed to reach out? Um, and we should. We should reach out. To Jesus when we need those type of things. Um, you see I have a little friend here and um, he, there are 11 others, I made a dozen of these um, 10 years ago when I lost my dad. Um, I needed something to grab onto, to hold onto and um, so what I did, and I had never done this before, didn't know what I was doing, I just know that I needed it. So I took his shirts, and he had two little Westy puppies, and so I found and made this little puppy pattern because uh, it reminded me of him and his love of Westies, and of course it's made from his shirts, and I remember him wearing them. And um, But the collar was made specifically from the hem or an edge of one of his favorite shirts that he would wear on uh, special special days. Um, so that's kind of calming and soothing for me. It helps me. Um, not only that, um, I wanted to share this with you know brothers and sisters and family and my children, uh, so they too could have a remembrance of of my dad, um, which is good. So. Um, when you need to reach out and touch something, maybe you can't reach out and touch Jesus' cloak, uh, but maybe you can touch something that um, will bring you calm and bring you peace. I know the world is a little crazy right now, and we just need to um, just figure out, think, and, um, you know, be, be at peace. As the scripture says, be still and know, I am God.